We are here doing demonstrations to show the public how we make things on a lathe. A lot of people have no idea what a lathe is. People think wood turning is a craft. We want to show them it's an art. Everything that you see on display here is something that one of our members has made. This year I think we have 48 different items. Anywhere from bowls to rolling pins to spurtles, which is something that most people have never heard of before. The spurtle was, was invented in Scotland maybe five or six hundred years ago. It's essentially a stick that has a round point on it because if you look at the bottom of a pan, the pan is round, you can't get in there with a wooden spoon, but now you can with a spurtle. It's fun to get somebody who's never done it, and I'll tell somebody, you know, you can put this on top of a pot. It, it, it eliminates the boiling over because it breaks the surface tension. Somebody in the back, I know, I've got one and it works. I like that. We have people that are 90 years old that are unbelievable turners. And anybody other than that can learn from them. They're expert turners, but more importantly, their, their finishing is fantastic. The technique to get this perfectly straight is difficult. The technique to get this in to match this in is difficult. It's a learning experience for the members. It's also a great product for the, for the public. This year we've changed to what we call French rolling pin. This has a gentle curve. So in our chapter, our focus is to educate our members to know how to turn, take members that have been around for a long time and help them learn how to do it better. We have expert trainers that work with them on the basic skills, just like anything. Before you can be an Olympic swimmer, you've got to learn first how to swim. It's no different in wood turning. We want to start with the basics and then help them grow and then see how creative we can get. And from looking around at some of the entries that our turners have done, you can see it's quite a broad spectrum of creative people. There are a variety of categories here in the wood turning. Judging each item within that category, um, I'm looking for you know the techniques that were used to, to turn that, um, what sort of skill level might have been uh, necessary to, to produce that, um, what the finished wood looks like. Um, that shows a lot of technique and how that's that's done. The reality is is that most woods turn really really well. In wood turning, a, a little more uh, uniquely than other areas of woodworking. You can literally take the tree down out of your backyard and turn it. Wood turning is probably the one part of woodworking that intimidates me the most. So uh, that thing moving at 900 miles an hour and trying to put a blade on it, uh, that could be intimidating. We have an 18 year old son and we've never bought him video games, but he has a wood shop in the backyard. So I think this is probably next level for him is what he's looking forward to. So. What I would like to see more of is more of the younger generation because for too long this has been an old man's club. That's not the case. Some of the best turners in the country are female. There is absolutely room in the boat for everybody. 